Word. Okay, so um, so what questions or what do you feel like you struggle with that I can help you with so far? Um, probably just um, announcing that I am a coach, like in a correct way, and talking to people. I have a hard time talking to people pretty much about it. Okay. I don't know why, but I do. <laughs> what, um, and that's, that's totally normal. That's usually one of the a common thing when you're a new coach. So what do you have a trouble talking to people about specifically? Um, I guess when I, okay, for instance, I have this girl that I work with and she has ordered Shakeology from me before. So she likes the shakes. But I can't get her to sign up as like a coach so she gets her own discounts. I feel like she uses me for the discounts because I let it go one time. Oh, but she if ordered I, through your account? She ordered from me, and then now she wants to keep ordering from me instead of signing up as herself. So I told her she could sign up as a coach and get the same discounts as I do, and I explained okay. all the pricing to her, and she just wants to order through me. Okay, so what I would say is, is you found out that you're actually not allowed to do that. Okay. And I would say, that. Yeah, and just say, girl, I would love to, but, um, you know, I didn't realize it, but I'm not allowed to do it. But technically, there's like a you plus one rule, so that if you wanted somebody else to, you could. She didn't need to know that. Um, just kind of be like, I just feel uncomfortable doing that since I found out that I'm not technically supposed to do that. So okay. I just want you to get it for the best deal. Um, and the cool thing is, is that basically as you're using it, all you got to do is talk to people about it and you can actually get it paid for just by getting a couple people to do it with you. Mm -hmm. Yeah, so, that's what I was trying to do. And she likes it and she yeah. does the program, but she just won't sign up as a coach. I'm like, Okay. <laughs> and so and so what I tell people is because a lot of times the, the word like coach kind of freaks people out and they're like, I'm not ready to be a coach. I tell people there are hundreds and hundreds of people. There are 300,000 people that are like over 300,000 coaches, probably mm -hmm. over, you know, 50,000 of them. At, I would say at least literally don't work for business. They just do it because they love the product. Yeah. So just say like it doesn't you don't if you don't want to work it, you don't have to. But if you want okay. to get your um shake all the paper, you have that option. But honestly, you have no obligation. You don't have to order every month. There's no quota. The only thing that she would have to do is pay that monthly fee. Mm -hmm. She would get twenty five percent off everything she sells. Yeah, that's what I'll I'll have to explain it to her tomorrow and see what she says, but like, yeah, well, yeah, what I would just say is, like, you know, I, I hate having this conversation, but I just learned that I'm not allowed to do that. So mm -hmm. just because I really do want to make this business something and I'm excited about it, I don't want to do anything that could, you know, compromise myself as a coach. Um, but I do want to make sure that I, ha I help you get the cheapest because, you know, I love it and I would just love to put it together, you know. Mm -hmm. kind of, and when you put it that way, she's going to be like, oh, I understand. Yeah, I, she should. She will. Yeah. So, um, yeah, and then um, the announcing yourself. Okay, somebody else jumped on. So who else jumped on with us? It's another eight. Kara. Kara. Okay. Kara. Oh, okay. <laughs> Hi. I am. Hi. Um, I just have. I just have to keep it on mute because I have four girls in my car. Oh, no, you're fine. I just wanted to say hi and let you know um, Karen and Ashley and I are all on. Okay. And then the other thing you were asking about is how to announce yourself as a coach. Mm -hmm. Basically, I would just find like a cute picture of yourself. It can be in your family. It can just be you, whatever. Um, and you're kind of just letting people know like, hey, you know, recently I decided to, you know, kind of make a change in my life. And, um, you know, I, I just decided that I want to help other people. Hold on. I'm, I had some feedback. So, um. Hold on one second. Um, so I just decided that I wanted to help other people and keep myself on track. And so I signed up to be an online health and fitness coach. So I say that versus Beachbody coach. 
Because in a lot of people's mind, people are like, oh my gosh, there's another Beachbody coach in my news feed. And even though we don't do our business that way, there's plenty of coaches that do. So that kind of doesn't even really mean much to a lot of people. So I, I always tell people to say, I've decided to sign up to be an online health and fitness coach. You know, I don't pretend to be perfect, um, but I'm excited to keep myself on track and also, you know, help other people on, along my journey. So if you're interested in, you know, starting a healthy lifestyle or just need to get back on the wagon, just shoot me a message because I'd love to, you know, just keep each other accountable. So um, something kind of like that, just announcing that you're there, people have questions or anything like that. Okay. Yeah, I've been posting like my results that I have each round, mostly my pictures on Instagram because it's private. Mm -hmm. And I do have a couple people that have commented on it. Mm -hmm. um, they are currently with other coaches from Beachbody, so I don't want to obviously take them from their coaches mm -hmm. or whatnot. But I do have one girl that still is not ready to do, I think, the full on four. She's just starting to get into the gym and everything now. And I keep trying to contact her, but she doesn't really reach back out to me. And I don't want to overstep my boundaries with right. her or anything like that. So I think yeah. I'll keep posting stuff to see if she yeah. catches on. And be consistent and, you know, I, with people that kind of on Instagram, I'll let, make a list of other people's Instagram um, and kind of check in on them throughout the week and just kind of be like, oh, good job, girl, you know, things like that. Um, the other thing that I would do is post your results. I know okay. it's scary. <laughs> but honestly, you can build such a successful business through Facebook. And so I look at it like this. Nobody is going to look at you and be like, oh my gosh, you look so fat. Like nobody's going to they're going to say, oh my gosh, girl, your results are amazing. Good for you. And you are just so focused. We in general are so focused at, oh my gosh, look at that before picture. I don't want people to see that. And what other people see is, dude, look what she did. Mm -hmm. So that's just kind of something you have to get out of your head because if you want to help and inspire people, if you want to help somebody look at you and say, if she can do it, I can. So you just kind of yeah. have to do it and like close your eyes and push that. <laughs> <laughs> um, and just kind of, and you, you can always preface it with, this was not easy for me to post. Mm -hmm. And I was very self-conscious about posting this, but my hopes are that if I can help one person, you know, learn a little bit more about nutrition and feel better in their skin than it was worth it for me. So you can preface it with that and people are, are going to be like, oh my gosh, you're such, you're such an inspiration. Like, I just love your results. I needed to see this today. Mm -hmm. So when you preface it with that, like, hey guys, this was hard for me. Like, you know, people are like, oh, and she didn't even want to show it. Like, good for her, you know, because it takes guts to do that. Yeah. But that's what's going to push your business forward. And Ashley can attest to that. I mean, Ash, when you write your post, you notice. Sorry, what, when I what? I, I heard until it's when I was unmuted. Um, are you 8813225? Eight, eight, yeah. Okay. Okay, I'm here. Now you're on mute. You're on mute. Um, so when, what do you notice when you post uh, like your before and after? I can't really hear you good. When you post your before and afters, do you notice like a pickup in people messaging you or commenting or wanting information? Yeah. Okay. I mean, Every time I post any results, I get tons of messages from people. Yeah. Your personal results are huge. That's, you know, you, I can share my sister's results. You know, Melissa Ludwig, if you've seen from our team, her results are awesome. But if, until I share mine, that's when people, because people connect with me. They're following me for a reason. And, yeah, it's cool to have somebody else to say, this person did this, and look how great she looks. But when it's you, your followers and your friends are going to be like, dude, whatever you're doing, I want to do it with you. So. Yeah, that's huge. Okay, we had somebody else jump on, too. Who did you say? Bethany, maybe? Hi, yes. Hey, girl. How are you? Sorry, I, I have a fussy baby. I'm trying to take a walk with him, oh. so it took me a minute. <laughs> no, you're fine. You know, it's like bedtime and <laughs> all Oh, that. yeah. 
happy time Yay. and everything else. So, <laughs> so um, okay, so Kara is muted. She's she's in the car and busy, but um, um, so I just kind of talked to Taryn about introducing herself, and I did record this all too, so um, you guys can listen back to what you missed. Um, so Taryn kind of asked me about how to introduce herself, and I kind of really encouraged her to start uh, to post her um, before and afters because she's posted it on Instagram, and so I told her to make sure she does it on Facebook. So um, Bethany, what questions do you have? Um, basically, I guess how to get people started. I, I don't know. Like I'm usually pretty good at this, and I posted a few pictures you know, on Instagram and stuff, and I have a few people messaging me, but um, I just want to get people, like, go, more people going. Okay. That's my problem. All right, so do you have a I'm list? I'm not really of, sure. Do you have a list of 150 people? <laughs> do I have Bethany's a list? Really, Bethany's really new. She didn't even finish her full 21 days yet. I was going to say, yeah. Okay, so, so. she's just getting started into it. Yeah. When did you sign on as a coach? Um, probably, I think like 15 days ago, 16 days ago, okay. something like that, a couple of weeks ago. So. Okay. That's totally fine. It's never too early to, to start. So, um, basically what you would do is go through your phone and go through your Facebook uh -huh. list and write down a list. And this is for everyone of 150 people. And it sounds okay. super daunting, but honestly, you can do that in 15 minutes because uh -huh. your Facebook friends, your people in your phone. Um, and I like to star people that I think would be good at coaching. Um, okay. So that I know that, that those are the people I'm going to talk to about coaching. And But those people on your list, and you're just going to message three of those people a day. So that's a great okay. list of people for you to start reaching out to. So I, that three people a day, you're going to form them. And the form stands, F stands for family. Hey, how's your family doing? Oh my gosh, your little one is getting so big. I can't believe they just started second grade. Like, how the heck are you guys? Um, o stands for occupation. You know, how's work going? Are you still at the same place? What are you doing? Um, and then you, you can say, you know, and I just, you can say if you, you know, about your job or I always, always, always say, and I just started my own business, um, you know, with health and as a health and fitness coach. So just trying to, you know, balance everything with the kids and this and that, you know, whatever. And I always uh -huh. tell people that I started a business or say something about my health and fitness business. It doesn't matter if you haven't made a penny. That's the entire reason you're reaching out to them. So you want to tell them that. That plants a seed that they're like, oh, I can go to her if I have questions, you know, kind of thing. Okay. Okay. So, um, so that's the O. The R stands for recreation. You know, maybe they went camping. Maybe you saw them. Um, you know, um, basically just you, it, depending on the person, some type of thing about recreation, um, if you can. And then the M is to message. And so I message these people to join our free exercise group. So instead of being like this weird, awkward conversation that I hold for two days, like talking about the weather that you just feel like uh -huh. obligated to respond to, I'm like in and out that first message when I, Hey, how's it going? Catch up. And then I compliment them and I say something like, well, you know, it was so good to catch up. You know, I always love talking to you and you're so positive and I'm always looking for other, you know, um, you know, happy women or busy, happy, busy moms that I could add to my free exercise group. So um, what do you say? Okay. I just add you and it's just a little bit of extra exercise every day and um, we can keep each other accountable. How does that sound? And so okay. we have an ongoing um free exercise group, which is great because then in a couple of days you can follow up with them and, Hey, how's it going? How's your exercise? Oh my gosh, I have two days to make up today. How about you? Versus if she wasn't in a free exercise group and you were like, Hey, how's your exercise going? They'd be like, fine. Thanks. Like, <laughs> why are you <laughs> yeah. so, um, I think that's my, let me turn my Facebook off. It's making noises. Hold on. Um, so, so yeah, so the free groups are really great because then you can just get people in there and it opens up a new window to be able to talk to, to them. And I actually uploaded um, a, a script on how to follow up with my free customers and start talking to them about the 21-day fix. Okay. Um, 
So, because it's so easy. Let me, I, I, I will, um, I can find it, but I just want to get it up so I can kind of read it to you guys so you can kind of get an idea of once somebody is in our free group, um, what, so I have a binder and I write down when I add somebody to our free group. Um, let me see, for, um, I'm gonna share my screen here and so you can see. Um, okay. So the, here's a message, and I said, hey, girl, how are things going? I hope you're loving our free exercise group. I have two days to make up today. Ha, ha, how about you? Since you're wanting to improve your fitness, I was wondering if you'd be interested in joining our next fitness and nutrition boot camp starting August. This was like a couple weeks ago. I provide the meal plans, the workouts, the portion control containers, and the motivation. I also am mailing out free shaker cups to all my August 10th boot campers. That, that's something I was doing. You would say, I'm also giving an extra free meal plan. You can do anything for free. Like you can okay. make something free yourself to give them. It doesn't even have to be anything involving money. Um, okay. and as an extra thanks for being a rock star, would you want to find out if it's for you or not? Nobody's going to be like, no, thanks. I'm good. You know, like, I mean, yeah, right. For right. The most part, they're at least going to be like, yeah, sure. Tell me. Um, and okay. so, and so then I just kind of, um, you know, catch caught up with her a little bit. Um, and then I started talking to her about, you know, okay, well, you know, I, I totally understand, like, it's so easy to fall off the wagon, um, but so hard to get back on. So for three weeks, I could hook you up with a fitness program and a nutrition guide that maps out for you, you know, what you can eat, blah, blah, blah. So then I, I kind of went through and followed the 21 day fix. So this is, um, in our coaching group. Um, and you can find this script. I just kind of copied and pasted a conversation I had and she ended up signing up with a 21 day fix challenge back just because I reached out to her. She was already in our free group. And I was like, I know you already, you know, are wanting to, you know, work on bettering yourself. Let's tell me about you. Like, what are your goals? You know, kind of thing. So you really go in and start talking to them about their struggles. If it's fitness, if it's nutrition, what their goals are, okay. um, you know, that kind of thing. So okay. that's why I really um, love our free groups. And, you know, uh, you can, I also, we also have a free seven-day clean eating group that is um, the second Monday, let's see, uh, first Monday of every month. And that's also, like, a great kind of thing to get them into that and then kind of follow up with them, like, hey, how's it going? How are your meal plans going? Um, and you guys can easily start your own free groups, you know? It doesn't even have to be anything. You, we just look for an exercise schedule on Pinterest, slap it in the group as the photo, and then tag people, uh, you know, on the photo as we add them. You can do, you know, free groups on your own, or we already do them, I and you can join us. But um, that's a beautiful thing for just kind of at the end of every conversation, that's what I'm going to do. I'm going to ask them okay. to join our free group. Um, and if you haven't, have you announced yourself, Bethany, yet as a coach? Um, have I? Like, what do you mean? I'm like on Facebook and stuff? Yeah. 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 Okay. All right, cool. I should probably do it again. <laughs> yeah. I mean, you can always just make a post and be like, you know, I, I just really in, enjoy, you know, that now I have the opportunity to, to help other people when they're struggling. And, you know, even though sometimes I find my own self struggling, it's really good to know that you're not alone. And, you know, I just want you to know if you have any questions, just know that you can come to me. I'm here. You know, just kind of putting okay. that general in, like thing out there makes people feel like, oh, that's so cool. Like I can go to her or, you know, some people might be like, oh, I just had a quick question. I was going to order, you know, this such and such, you know, whatever, what do you think about this? Um, so you'll find that the more that you can just kind of document your journey. So if you're eating lunch, instead of just not snapping a picture of it, obviously if you're following 21 Day Fix, it's going to be somewhat healthy. Take a picture of it uh -huh. and write down what it is. Like last night I made zucchini tacos, and they're super easy to make. I took a picture of it, wrote down the um, – uh, recipe. It literally took me like three minutes to write out. I got like five people share it. I got a ton of comments. I got a bunch of likes all because people are like, Oh my gosh, I have all the ingredients. This is so awesome. Thank you so much. That okay. I, mean, I didn't make the recipe myself. I just, <laughs> it up there. you know, I wasn't, um, I'm not chef Ramsey over here. I don't do anything complicated. <laughs> whatsoever. 
but just sharing that people are like, Oh, this is awesome. Thank you. Um, you know, and just kind of talking to people, you know, talking about your workout and talking about, um, you know, it, oh, you know, non-scale victories or today I chose this and it made, you know, water and I can't believe that I've been, you know, three weeks without diet pop or, you know, something like that. So just kind of talking uh -huh. about little things. If you have a client that, you know, it could be anything. Like if you have a client that's down two pounds, like I, I have a girl that, um, she is a free lead. She didn't even buy it for me. So I didn't get any commission from her, but she is rocking the 21 day fix. Cause I emailed her. I reached out to me. She added me on Facebook. I got her added to one of our groups and she is doing awesome. But she was like, thank you so much. Like I just couldn't bring myself to start because I didn't feel motivated. And she got in our group and she started, you know, and she's, she's down a couple pounds. And so I, it would be cool. I could just make a simple post. I don't even need a picture and be like, dude, my girl, so-and-so or one of my, you know, challengers is down two pounds in a week and I'm just so proud of her. You know, it can be, um, you can add up a couple of your clients and say something. Ashley's really good at that. She's, she's done that kind of post a couple times of being proud of people. Uh -huh. You can ask people for their before and afters. I know even Kara, I think a couple times she shared her, she would say like another headless boot camper or something like that. And she would share with us. It was really <laughs> cute. Um, so just okay. ask people for testimonials and, and just invite people because even when people say no, it's not no forever. It's just no right now. Like I have so right. many people that come back later and they're like, dang, why did I not start with you when you first asked me? Like, yes, can I join you now? Whether it's coaching or okay. asking people to be clients. Okay. So like yeah. me, it took me a year to finally yeah. give in. Yeah. <laughs> um, the most perfect book you can read is Go For No. It's awesome. It's such a good book. It's a short book, or you could do the audio book. It's super short. Um, there's an app. It's called Audible, A-U-D-I-B-L-E. Um, you can sign up for a free month and get a free download. Um, so you could get, like, that book for free with your free download. Um, if you don't cancel it, there's a monthly charge. I think it's, like, maybe 10 bucks. I'm not sure, but you can cancel it. Um, but I love it. I keep it because I get a free credit every month. So every month I get a free audiobook, you know, with my subscription. So that's really cool because I listened to a book in three days this week that has been on my um, bookshelf for literally almost a year, and I haven't even opened it. I just can't do books. Like, I like, oh, I'll read it before bed, and I like pass out every time. I never do it. So, <laughs> if you have a commute in the car, or some, or you know, you are able to do um, some type of personal development when you're driving or doing something, um, you know, all of our national wake up calls are recorded, all of our team calls are on my YouTube channel. Um, so another great personal development is all the national wake up calls. And if you um, have an iPhone under the podcast um, app, you're going to download team beach bodies podcast. Um, if you have a Samsung, you'll download the app. It's called podcast addict. A D D I C T. Um, so it's basically like an app to be able to access podcasts because you don't have an iPhone. And then from there you download team beach body um, Shalene Johnson has two podcasts. She has Shalene Johnson show and build your tribe. I love Shalene Johnson. She's like, I just want to be her. She's amazing. Um, she's the woman that did Pio and, um, she does a lot of personal development stuff now and she's just really awesome at Instagram. She's got a lot of really great tips. Um, so those are all for free personal development for you, but the more that you can do personal development on a regular basis, the better why I love go for no so much is it teaches you who cares if they say no. Like I would rather somebody tell me no than me not share this opportunity with me because I think about it. If I didn't find this opportunity till two years down the road, cause nobody ever invited me, I would, I, I would literally hate my life right now. <laughs> like I made a post today about how bad I hated my job before this and you know, all that stuff. So it's just so cool to think, wow, like in two and a half years, look what I've done. I can't imagine if I waited, if somebody waited two years to invite me. So you kind of have to think like, how dare I not share this with somebody when it could change their life, you know, with 21 day fix or, or coaching. I'll let them tell me no kind of thing. Okay. 
Because you guys do it all the time. You go to a restaurant, it's good. You're like, oh my gosh, girl, it, it had the best like cheesecake. You have to go. It's the same thing. This program is awesome. You have to try it. We should do it together. It's the same thing. And nobody says, oh, does the restaurant give you a kickback because you told me? Nobody, you know, like when you're sincere about it and you're just like, dude, you have to join me. That's the thing is you're being a product of the product and you're just like, we should totally do this together. It would be so cool to keep each other accountable. People are going to be like, okay. So, you know, if you have a couple girlfriends that, you know, have been struggling that you think would benefit from it, just invite them. They might say no, but that's okay. Like, why would you not invite your girlfriends when you see personally how well it works, you know? So, um, any other questions? What else are you guys struggling with or what else can I help you with? Um, for like Kara, she has like no problem kind of getting her friends to join us in the challenge group and whatever. And she like can sell her challenge packs good, mm -hmm. but she hasn't, um, parents her only coach and mm -hmm. she, ha she doesn't really know how to, instead of just getting them to join the group, how to get them into coaching and why she wants to get them coaches instead of just like members. Okay. So I feel like that was kind of you too. I just was like, girl, you got to sign on coaches and you're like, okay, but you didn't really know why <laughs> you're just doing it. Yeah. <laughs> so, so understanding why is huge. Okay. So once you start getting people on your team, you start making money every week from your team cycle bonus. Once you're Emerald, you have two coaches, you can start making a cycle bonus. So right now for me, 85% of my paycheck comes from my team cycling bonus. That is a lot of money that I'm not doing anything for other than like mentoring my coaches. So um, the most important thing that you can do is start building your team. If you ask any coach that like kind of put off asking people to join their team, their biggest regret is I didn't start building my team soon enough because you don't have to be like, oh, I don't feel like I'm a good enough coach yet. I don't care. I tell Ashley all the time and Ashley is so good at this. She's like, she'll just be like, I don't girl. I'm just still figuring it out. I don't even really know what I'm doing, but it's awesome. And you can get your shake out you paid for. And you know, and you can be upfront with them. You can be like, I just started, but my coach Ashley or my coach Kara, you know, or my coach April, they're rock stars. They'll help us. The cool thing is, is you don't have to be perfect. You know, if you needed to be, uh, have a six pack or, you know, have a degree in nutrition, Beachbody would require a certification, but they don't because they want real people to encourage people that they know what it's like to struggle. They know what it's like to you know, fall off the wagon. So I just kind of tell people based, I ask them what their struggles are. So if their struggle is motivation, coaching is going to be huge for them. One, you're not going to tell people to go do their 21 day fix when you're sitting on the couch eating Oreos, you know? So I tell them about how, Oh my gosh, girl, this group is so perfect because not only are you now encouraging other people, but you are supported by this awesome, you know, positive community of people. And then it encourages you to keep going and you are able to invite more people and help change lives in the process. Um, so you don't have to be perfect. You are just on your journey and you're able to help and invite other people. So, you know, it's kind of a no brainer. If you, if you're loving what you're doing anyways, why not get your Shakeology cheaper and help other people and make money in the process? So you're just kind of inviting people like that. And if it's somebody that hasn't tried it yet, um, I didn't try Shakeology before I signed on as a coach. I was just like, sure, okay, let's do this. Because I was really interested in quitting my job. For me, that was my biggest thing. It wasn't so much weight loss. Um, I had already lost, you know, some weight. I was, I was, I had a little bit, I was at a plateau, but that wasn't my main priority. My main priority was I hate my job. I feel unfulfilled. I am broke. I need to get out of the situation. So everybody is kind of different. Um, I know that your vibe attracts your tribe. So, you know, if you're typically attracting other busy moms who just want to kind of get rid of some baby weight and feel more comfortable in their skin, it, you may talk to people different. So it's kind of important to know their goals and their struggles to know how to talk to them. If it's motivation that they're lacking, you're going to talk up the support and the accountability group and your challengers and your coaches. And if it's, um, the financial, you're going to talk to them about that. Um, and if they're scared because they don't have the time, you're going to say, girl, you're on Facebook anyways. It's all you do is you use Facebook differently now. Um, because when people tell me I don't have the time, I'm like, I had three jobs when I started. And at one point I was working full time 
um, doing beach body, planning a wedding, um, and um, teaching fitness classes. And so you just kind of have to tell other people's and don't take down the time that like Ashley has two kids and you know, um, Josh is at work. So a lot of the time she's doing, you know, it all and, and doesn't even have internet <laughs> and makes it work. So use your story, use other people's story and be like, uh, if you can give me 30 minutes to an hour a day, you can make this work. It's, I don't know how much you, time you think that you need to put in, but it's really not that big of a deal. It's, it's, you can lurk as little or as much as you want to. Um, and so every, uh, if you go to my YouTube, just search April McDonald, um, I have this one playlist and it's called How to Battle Objections. And there's six different videos and they're only a minute long each. And for every objection basically anybody will ever give you, I tell you how to battle that. If somebody says, I don't have the time, I give you a couple testimonials you can use. And, and um, if somebody says, I don't have the money, um, I had $7 in my bank account when I started. I put it on my credit card. I'm like, ah, uh, yeah, no, that excuse actually doesn't work. Um, unless people don't have a credit card, which some people do, don't. And I'm like, well, one, I'm kind of jealous because you don't have credit card debt. But I, two, I don't get how that's possible. <laughs> but good for you. <laughs> but um, yeah, so there's um, some people might tell you I don't, I'm not fit enough. I don't know enough about fitness and nutrition. Um, you know, so every, all of my objections, there's a minute long of how I personally respond to those people, um, and kind of tell them like, you don't have to be perfect. The best coach is somebody that's relatable. You know, I have coaches that are, you know, 200 some pounds, but you know, I tell them like, good for you because you are going to attract other women just like you who need to make a change. Um, and, and I would just kind of really focus this, focus on being you and don't try to be perfect and don't try to sugarcoat yourself. Like I tell people like if I had too much chocolate or if I had wine, like because people want to know that. And for a while, I think I tried to be too perfect and people were like, Oh, thank God you are normal. And I'm like, Oh, that's not what I want to put out there at all. So just kind of talk about you talk about your family. Um, you know, you've seen that I'm always posting about my dog or guacamole or like, I don't even know how this started, but everyone knows I'm obsessed with like Chipotle and, and stuff like that, but just put stuff out there so that people can feel like they know you so that other people can relate to you, you know, pictures of your kids or funny things that your family did or, you know, stuff like that. Show your sense of humor. Um, and put yourself out there so that people can really connect with you. And if you can share your story, um, share your results, that's huge. And that's just one more way that people are going to connect with you guys. Kara, do you have anything else you want to ask? Kara, are you still there? <laughs> oh, Kara? Um, yeah. There, she's unmuted. Kara? Oh, no wonder you couldn't hear me earlier when I was talking away. <laughs> <laughs> you said you were going to mute yourself, and I think I, I muted you too accidentally. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> yeah. No, I have a girl that actually just messaged me at like 6 o'clock tonight and said, okay, tell me about this 21-day fix. Um, I heard you told somebody at work about it, and I started following you on Facebook, and you look awesome. And so I sent her my pictures, and she said that's all I needed to see. I'm ready to do it. What do I do? I said, I'll call you later. I have so much to do right now. I just said, you know, I told her a few basic things. I said, I'll call you back at nine. But like, like Ashley said, I need to get, I've got probably three people this week that might sign on under me, but I don't know how to get that out. So um, I guess that's okay. all I'm going to try and do is talk them into doing it so that they can get it cheaper, which is honestly the reason I was doing it to start was just to get my stuff cheaper because I didn't want to pay for it every month. Right, and that's all you have to do. So I give people the general information about the 21 Day Fix, why I loved it, what it did for me, and then I say, and you know what else is really cool? Is that I actually started doing this because I just wanted to sign up just to get my discount, and what's really cool is I'm actually able to help other people, you know, really feel better about themselves, and through that, you know, get my technology paid for. So... You know, I, I always encourage people to do it the same way I did so that you can save 25% on your technology, get great results, and help the people you love do the same thing. You know, do, you know of a couple of people that could benefit from, you know, feeling better about, you know, this, about being in their own skin. 
and nobody's going to be like, no, I don't know anybody like that. You know? <laughs> so um, that's all I would do. I would, I would tell her the basics first and then tell her why you got in it, why you like it, and why it would benefit for her. Okay. And just and just be honest, like I got in this honestly just to get my stuff cheaper. And now it's actually cool to be able to invite, you know, friends and family to, to do this with you and watch everybody, you know, start this new healthy lifestyle around you. And so then it's even cooler because you have other people doing it with you and it's not like you're the only person, you know, trying to get healthier. You have a support system of other people doing it with you. Right. Okay. So, but yeah, the, the reason why you, you build your team is to be able to get that cycle bonus um, and to be able to just make a little extra money. Um, you know, every Matt's account, my husband, I work his business and I signed him on and I work his, his account and just, and I don't really even do too, too much with it, but. Um, you know, because I signed on like two and a half years ago, his account alone makes me like 300, 350 a week just from that volume that I've built by adding a couple coaches in there um, and putting a couple customers under there. And so mine is, my cycle bonus is, is greater because I primarily have my account. But just think about it. I mean, can you imagine $300 a week that you didn't even do anything for? Like, it's really cool. So, so just know that in order to, in the down, down the line, if you're thinking about, okay, I want to be able to make something that's going to be able to pay me back, you don't want it to just be focused on what you're selling. Your, you know, commission alone is going to be really hard to build that pay. So that's when the cycle bond helps to get that extra. Do you think that maybe um, after this conversation or sometime tonight, you can send me on Facebook um, an inbox message and just tell me um, the difference between if I sign a couple girls or, you know, if I sign one of these girls on as a customer or if I sign her on as a coach, can you just tell me as a coach, you will get 25% off as a, just as one of the people that are under me, you're not going to get that. Or just tell me the benefits of, of being a coach over them just being a customer so that I can so I can read it and explain it better okay. when I talk to her. Yeah, I can do that. I'll just, okay. um, Ashley, will you start a group message with all of us and then I'll just send it so all everybody can have it? Yeah. Okay. Because, like, I know, like, the 25% off you'll get and stuff, but then I, I tend to forget, like, what the other details are. So if I have it written somewhere, then I, I'm better, I'll, you know, I can yeah. say it to people better because I'll, I'll get used to saying it. Like, okay, but if you do a coach, just like I did, you know, right away when I didn't even know what coaching was, mm -hmm. then these are the benefits. Yeah, basically, and I'll, I'll write it, but basically it's 25% off. You get the chance to um, uh, get your Shakeology paid for, and you get to help other, you know, women just feel comfortable in their skin. Those would be the three big okay. things for me. It's just how and, and the only other thing is that being a coach, they pay the 16 whatever a month, correct? I right. always add that into the Shakeology fee. Like, I just say, whenever I'm telling them, like, they get 25% off everything, and then I always tell them that they can save $15 on their Shakeology because, really, they can save 30 but then with that fee, it yeah. kind of, once it comes out the same day, it basically makes them save 15 still, even with the fee. Yeah, when you're just getting into talking to people, you just say, yeah, you're going you're gonna to save 15 bucks a month on Shakeology. Um, and then once they sign up, then that's when, like, um, you can be like, okay. So, it, it, you know, so you pay, you know, you'll get charged um, for your Shakeology, which will be about 100 and then the $15 a month fee for your websites, you know, your invoices and everything like that. So either way you want to do it, if you want to break it down before, if you wanted to break it down after, whichever is easier. Okay. A lot of people will ask, is there a monthly fee? I get asked that a lot, um, uh, you know, to be a coach. And I, I'll say like, yeah, it's, you know, um, $15.95 a month. So basically you're paying you know, 15 bucks a month for them to take care of customer service. They take care of the product. They ship the product out to your client. 
you don't have to buy stuff and carry it around and travel across the, you know, town to give people. You don't have to have stuff in bulk or, you know, have stuff for people to order from you. They take care of your invoices. If somebody's disc scratched, they're going to send it out. Right. So it's kind of like you owning a business without having to do the crappy part of owning a business. And that's kind of how I always break it down. They're like, oh, shoot. Okay, cool. Yeah, I don't want to do that stuff. <laughs> okay. Mm-hmm. All right. Does anyone else have any questions before we get off? Oh, Taryn. No, nope, I'm good. Oh, Taryn, I'm good. <laughs> did you say you're good? Yeah. Okay. Um, I posted a video, but let me um tell you guys this because this is just something I found out like in the last couple weeks. So when you first um sign on coaches, you have a left and a right leg. So you want one on your left and one on your right because that will make you emerald. And then in order to be diamond, which is your next kind of milestone that you want to hit, um, you have four coaches on one leg, four coaches on the other leg, and one coach on each leg then has two of their own coaches, so they're emerald. So one emerald on each leg and then three other active coaches on each leg. So eight all together um, and one on each leg have two of their own. But in order to get to diamond, I used to tell people, oh, yeah, as you add coaches, just go right, left, right, left. Um, and I realized that that is not smart <laughs> based on your cycle bonus because you have a strong leg and a weak leg. Your strong leg is whatever leg. So um, for me, Ashley is on my right leg. Wait. Yes, Ashley is on my right leg. So... Because she's on my right leg, her right leg is automatically her strong leg. Because as I add coaches, they're going to go underneath her. So she's already getting volume. If you log in, you may see coaches underneath you on one leg, and you're like, who are these people? It doesn't matter. They're not your coaches, but they add volume to your account, which is cool. So when once I have one coach on each leg, the weak leg, I'm going to get that side to four coaches before I go to my strong leg because that strong leg already has volume. But I'm going to build that weak leg with four coaches before I go to my strong leg because that's going to help with my cycle bonus. Does that make sense? That may be confusing. It's kind of a visual thing. So, it makes sense. Um, okay. But So we have a video that we can watch, but... So pretty much you guys want to get to Emerald having one coach on each leg and then we can kind of like go back into that and help yeah. you figure out where your, where your weak leg is and where your strong leg is and who needs to go where. Yeah. You'll, you'll just put, you, once you have one on each side, then you'll put the other three to get uh, the other three on whatever is your weak leg first because that helps with your cycle bonus. So kind of your goal is how much can I grow, grow my cycle bonus the fastest is gonna make you the most money. You know, you're gonna see that 14, that $28 extra each week and it adds up. So yeah, that's kind of something we can talk about, but I just wanted to make sure that um, I pointed that out and there's a, a video you guys can pick out too. But just don't be afraid to invite anybody. Let them tell you no if they tell you no good. And like Ashley, they'll probably come back in a year, <laughs> if not sooner. <laughs> I have one girl that's about to sign up this week that I asked her two years ago. So, you know, don't, who cares if they say no? Okay, cool. If you need anything, I'm here. That's, and I just keep inviting them to our free groups, and that's all you can do. Um, so get your list of 150 people and start reaching out to three to five people a day. Get them into your free group. Um, I, we have free groups. If you need added, just let us know. And um, feel free to get on the phone with Ashley or I or Kara or whatever if you want to do this. Um, you know, often that's fine with me. I'm happy to do it, okay? Okay. So. Thanks, April. Yeah, no problem. Thank you. Okay, well, have a good night. And I recorded this, so I will um, share that with you guys too, okay? Okay, thank you. No okay. problem. All right, bye, guys. Bye.